Hey and welcome to another Bad Eye Wake tutorial. This time, as requested by your votes, we'll do the DreamWorks intro, as you can see it here. Well done, boys. Looks like I scold sushi for breakfast. What you'll need. Blender. You can get this from the blender.org site. I'll be using the newest version 2.59, but any version should work. After Effects. You'll need a version of CS4 or higher. And finally the template file. So you can get these from the link in the description below. Oh, and you'll also need a computer, a mouse, a keyboard, a display and an IQ over 3. Now, if you do not have one of those things, like if you got an IQ of 1, or, and this is probably the reason why you would do this, you do not have the expensive Adobe programs, you can buy your custom intro from my homepage, balaiwake.co.cc. Now let's get started. You can download different template files for different variations of the DreamWorks intro. The involved steps to edit these intros are very similar. I'm gonna show it to you on the Madagascar variation of the DreamWorks intro. So after you've downloaded the zip folder, unzip it, this is very important. Then open up the folder and double click on the Blender file. Inside Blender you will have to edit every single letter individually because each letter has another color. So right click a letter to select it, press tab to enter edit mode and then change the letter to the one you want. Press tab again, then select the next letter, press tab and change it and tab again. So just right click to select, tab, change it and so on. If your title is longer there are spare letters on the side out here. Just right click them and then left click and drag on the red arrow to add the letters. To edit the subtitle, right click it, press tab and change it to your desired subtitle. Now up here in the main title you can see that the letters do not have the required space between them. So start spacing them so that every letter has enough space by right clicking them, left clicking and dragging on the red arrow. Finally, you can hold shift and right click on all letters to select them all and then center the main title. When you are satisfied with your results, click animation. Now double click on the After Effects file. Click Composition. Add to render queue, then click the lastless link. Here you will have to check the audio output, and under format options, you should select the DivX codec if available. If it's not available, just render without any compression and encode it afterwards. I have a tutorial for that, just click the annotation. Then click OK here, select your saving location, click save and then hit render. Your intro will now render. This should take between 2 and 10 minutes depending on your CPU and then you're done. I hope you liked this tutorial and hope to see you again soon for other tutorials. You can check my homepage for news or vote for the next tutorial. Bye!